Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be unboxing Ipsy for March 2021. This is what March's Ipsy bag looks like. There is this blue drawstring for the pouch and on the back it's just empty and says Ipsy just at the bottom there. Inside it is red and there's a quote here and it says confidence comes from within as well as the Ipsy Insignium here. Every month you also get a card that lists out the products and the retail values. So this month I got the five products that Ipsy sent me and then I also added on a few products that I'll go through at the end. Starting with what they selected for me. The first thing in my box is Araceli Beauty Ojo's Perfect Liquid Eyeliner. This is in the shade Night. This eyeliner is perfect right now because I only have one eyeliner that I currently use, so it's great to have a backup. The next thing that they selected for me is the Sophia and Maybell I Woke Up Like This Skin Perfecting Primer. I have never actually tried this primer before, but the one I'm using from Smashbox right now is amazing. So I'm gonna keep using that and then I'll try this one later. But it's always good to have another primer, especially in like a travel size once we are able to travel again. The product that I chose for this month is the Leave-In Conditioner. And it is by this famous brand that I do not know how to pronounce. <laughs> but I've had this product before in a FabFitFun box. I absolutely love the way that it made my hair smell and how it kind of calmed down the frizziness. So this is why I selected the product this month. The next product that Ipsy selected for this bag is the Lottie London Slay All Day Liquid Lipstick in So Good. This kind of looks like a deeper pinkish red shade. Um, on the brochure you can see that it actually is like a kind of color. Here it doesn't look quite like that, but I'm sure once you apply it, it is this kind of nice darker shade. The final product that Ipsy chose for my bag this month comes as a duo. It is the Cream Shop Fusion Sheet Mask Duo Blueberry Banana and Peaches Cream. So I always am happy to get sheet masks. I use them all the time. Last time I got sheet masks, there was one that I couldn't use because it had avocado in it. Um, so I'm really happy that the ones they sent me this month I can use and they will definitely be put to good use. Overall, out of all the things that they sent me, I think that my favorite is the one I chose tied with the sheet masks. And then my least favorite would probably be the primer right now, just because I have a really nice Smashbox primer that I'm like really invested in and I don't know if anything can top it. So this primer might be good, but right now based on the information I have, I really love the one I'm using. That was everything that I got for the March 2021 Ipsy Glam Bag. Now let's get into the add-ons I selected. The first add-on I selected comes as a duo here. The brand is Best Face Forward and one of the products is pimple patches where you can apply them to your face and it kind of helps diminish the pimples and targets them directly. And the, the other one is um, a toner that you can use. So I'll take out the toner so you can see what it looks like outside of this packaging. This is what it looks like. It is a nice kind of sheer blue color, um, which fits right in with the theme of my household. I have kind of like a teal aqua theme going on in my household. So this will sit perfectly in with that theme. And overall, I really like the packaging of this. I'm hoping that the formula is as good as the packaging. The next product I chose to add on is by Silky, and it is a hair mask that helps deep condition your hair. So the reason I added this on was because I think I saw some good reviews on it, and my hair always can use like a good deep condition. So I'm excited to try this product out. The final product that I added on is the one I'm most excited about. It is One Kind Dream Cream nourishing nighttime moisturizer. And the reason I got this product was because my skin is really dry naturally, especially when I wake up in the morning, it's very, very dry. And I haven't found like a good nighttime moisturizer. 
So I looked into this one. This one had some good ratings and it was reasonably priced. So I thought I'm gonna try this one out and see how it behaves with my skin. As a result of the add-ons that I chose, Gypsy sent me a free product, which I will also share with you right now. The free product is by PYT Beauty. It is a cool eyeshadow palette, day to night. Inside come four beautiful shades here with little labels. There is Now, Coffee Run, Day Trip, Later, Happy Hour, and 2.02 AM, as well as some instructions as to where you can put these on your lid for maximum effect. I will swatch all four just for you guys to see what they look like on. Overall, they feel really creamy while swatching, which is good. And the color's pretty pigmented. So this is what they look like swatched. The first one you can't really see here. Um, so that's definitely a very neutral tone that you'd have to build upon. And then this next one, the matte, you can see a little bit better. And then the two shimmer tones, you can see much better. So I love this neutral tone palette and I'm super happy that Ipsy sent it to me for ordering some add-ons. That's everything that's included in the Ipsy Glam Bag this month, plus my add-ons and the free product that Ipsy sent me. Let me know down in the comments below what you thought of the bag I got this month. Please also remember to subscribe to this channel to see lots of other content with unboxings and book hauls and all sorts of things like that, as well as to help me support building this channel. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you next time. Bye.